Acting Deputy President, and uh, thank you to the minister for giving me uh, some space to put on the record uh, my contribution. I'll, I'll keep it brief. Um, we know what the purpose of this bill uh, is for. It is to ensure that Australian artists um, are given due credit and uh, uh, payment uh, for their work, to protect them uh, from having their work stolen, uh, pirated uh, and abused. It will do this be through um, being able to target uh, those who intend to steal their work online. Uh, we know that, of course, um, while many Australian artists um, have had to adapt to the new world order of the, the, uh, the digital revolution, um, they've done so, um, having to back themselves, often uh, taking the risk financially uh, without uh, knowing exactly how that was going to pay off. And over the um, uh, recent years, we've seen Australian artists starting to do more and more uh, engagement with the digital world and to grapple with uh, the issues of, of copyright, but also how they reach audiences and build a reputation uh, and uh, support from those online audiences as well. This bill, um, uh, notwithstanding the comments put on the record by my colleague, uh, Senator Steelejohn um, will go some way to ensuring that uh, particularly small and independent artists um, can have at least an avenue uh, for protecting their work if indeed it is being in, uh, stolen or there is an infringement of copyright use uh, that undermines their ability to get paid. Um, we want to see uh, Australian artists supported more and more. Um, this uh, bill creates a pathway for artists and creators to have their rights protected. But we need to do more than this to ensure that Australian artists um, are really uh, given strong uh, policy backing uh, in this country. And that's one of the reasons why the Greens believe uh, strongly in a creative Australia. One of the reasons why we believe we need a creativity commission, an agency. Uh, in Australia that would uh, underpin and support Australian artists and the ability of creativity to permeate across all sections of the economy and society. We uh, believe fundamentally in the ability of the arts of creativity to improve all of our lives. We believe that our culture is made richer through the contribution of creative endeavours, and we believe that artists have the right to have their work protected. And that, of course, is artists who work offline, uh, but also those artists who work fundamentally and predominantly in an online and digital space. They too need to be uh, respected and uh, recognised for the amazing contribution that they give to innovation in this country. We pride ourselves on developing and advocating for strong poli policies to support Creative Australia, and that's why uh, we've been leading an inquiry into the Australian content uh, creation, ensuring that Australian stories are uh, promoted and supported uh, through the various different platforms, whether that's traditional broadcast or whether that is uh, platforms online or indeed even on radio. I note, uh, Madam Acting Deputy President, that today is the Australian Music Awards, the ARIA Awards, where uh, for, the, for the first time in a long time the majority of uh, nominees up for um, awards are, uh, are Australian artists who are coming back to Australia, investing back into the Australian creative environment, and having their works recognised uh, through those awards will be um, a great uh, thing to see happen uh, this evening. I just want to say uh, well done to all the nominees today uh, and uh, congratulations to those who ultimately win those awards as they're announced. Uh, later on tonight. A, creati a creativity commission um, would give uh, Australian artists and creators the ability to have uh, their contribution to the economy and to society recognised. We have a productivity commission, we have uh, the CSIRO, we have uh, the Human Rights Commission, all different areas which we understand deserve special recognition in a variety of uh, ways. It is time that Australian artists and creators also have uh, the backing of a government-funded agency that upholds uh, and promotes the 
benefits of creativity to our entire community economy and society. Something I'll be pushing for very strongly uh, over the coming months, and I look forward to discussions on both sides of the chamber as to how we can ensure Australian artists and creators uh, in the online and offline environment can be uh, supported better and wholeheartedly by all sides uh, of, of politics and all sides of the chamber. Thank you.